When, um, before I got diagnosed with lupus, I was having a lot of joint pain. Um, the rashes on my legs were hot and red, and they were very painful. And when I went to see the doctor, um, the first test they did is the lupus test because I had it in my background from my mom. I didn't have a lot of kidney problems back then. I was fine for 10 years. But then I, was, I started having um, kidney problems. My doctors tried many different treatments for my kidneys, but it didn't seem to be working. Since my doctors couldn't do anything else, they referred me to NIH. Um, I went there and they did a um, whole bunch of tests just to see if I qualified for the protocol they had. Um, my, I had a stem cell transplant in May 16. 2006. I was very scared. Um, I didn't know what was going to happen, but I was hoping to get healthier and also I want to find a cure for lupus. They gave me a chemotherapy treatment. I lost my hair and it grew back. It wasn't hard. Um, I, my face gets swollen a lot from the prednisone or the cortisone medications. It was difficult, it wasn't easy, but after all, I feel good now and I can say that I have a, almost a normal life. At NIH, they have great scientists that are working hard to help uh, people with lupus and find a cure. Medicine is going very far and before they didn't have a lot of medications, now they have more medications, more treatments, and I hope they can help a lot of people. I think that that's very important, that the Congress and the government helps for more research. Maybe we can find a cure for lupus someday.